this is Tally's first real little ride. I've sat on him a couple of times over the last few weeks. Yesterday I sat on him and just did a little circle or two in the round pen. Today, so far this morning, I've, um, I came out and I long-lined him in the arena for a little while, um, only about five minutes, just to get him going forward and being soft. And then I did some give to the bit work on the ground just to make sure he was paying attention and to get him nice and soft in the bridle. So this is really the first ride he's had um, since he was broken in. And he was actually broken in 18 months ago in a demonstration situation um, in Maroolan, in a round pen in Maroolan with the um, helicopters landing you know, 30 metres away from him. So what I want to do, first of all, is just keep him in walk and make sure that I've got some softness and some directional control. So he's doing well now. What I'm trying not to do is interfere with him too much. You can see I'm really exaggerating my cues just there when I wanted to ask him to step left a little bit. I really opened my left hand and now my right hand, the same thing. So he's, um, if he plays with a bit and tosses his head a little bit, I'm just going to try and leave him alone. He'll work out that he doesn't have to do that. I'm very concerned about softness and softness is my most important thing. I want him to be soft and listening. I don't want him pulling against my hand. Hello. Hello. How are you? Oh, good. Mm -hmm. How are you this morning? Good. How are you? Now I'm going to just make sure that I've got some breaks and just check that he stops when I ask him to stop. He has done right there and immediately I release the rein and praise him. Wow. As soon as his feet stop moving, remember to release the rein. And I'll try that a few more times. I want to try that a few times before I ask him to trot. And also make sure I can stop, you know, in both directions here is slightly bent to the left. There we are, stopping well now. And you can see I'm giving him a few cues. I'm putting my weight back and my feet forward. Now I'm just going to ask him for a few strides of trot. I don't want him to trot round and round in circles forever the first time. Just a few strides and bring him back to walk and praise him for that. And that was really good. And I'll do that a few more times. And then um, he's had, I think, a six minute ride and that's long enough. Then it's really done very well with that. I'm going to ask him to stop again and then release the rain and tell him he's brilliant, which he is.